Today we will see introduction to random bubbles. So we go to our picture block interface and start coding for random bubbles. So the first thing we need to do is we need to delete our sprite Toby. We don't want Toby. I want bubbles. So I require ball, right? So I delete my sprite Toby. So I delete it. Then search for a sprite. So choose a sprite. Click on search and I see ball. Okay. And I select a ball. Okay. Now go to events and say green flag. Why I require green flag? So that I can execute my program without green flag can I execute no now do I need to draw anything I just want random bubbles right so I don't require to draw okay so I don't use clean slate so I go to motion straight away and I say x and y axis zero I will make it zero why I make it zero so that my sprite is in the center of the stage then I say point in 90 direction we finish with one part then I go and create my blocks. So I go to my blocks and I create a block. So make a block and I say grow. Okay. And I have a input steps. And I say okay. Now we will program for this block. Yes. Now I go to event control. And I say if and else, I require if and else. So top if, I require an operator. So click on it and I search for equal to. If steps equal to zero, then what it has to do? Change the size of the ball, right? If steps equal to zero, go to looks and say change size by, I say five. And I go to my blocks and I call my block grow. Okay. And I give operator minus yes. So I say steps minus one. And if steps minus one, then what it has to do? Set the size. Okay. Set the size to certain amount. So I go to looks and I say set the size to 50 instead of 100 I make it 50 then I create one more block so I go to my block and I say make a block and I say randomly I'll give a name random grow and shrink okay and I say okay I don't give any input for this Now, I say random, so I go to motions and search for random. So go to random positions. Why I say random position? I don't want my balls, okay? That is the ball to come, you know, in one place only. It should move, okay? Now it should come to certain, it should move in the stage, okay? So it may be towards left, right, center, horizontal, vertical, whatever, okay? So it should be randomly in any way of the stage. So what I have to do, I have to create a clone of what? I have to create a clone of, clone of my cell, that is my ball, okay? So I go to control, come down, search for create clone of myself, okay? And then it should wait, correct? Wait for certain seconds. So I say 0 0.02 seconds, okay? Again, I'll make one more clone. So create a clone of myself and I say wait for 0 0.02 seconds again I'll make one more clone so create a clone and straight away I go to my blocks and I call my block grow grow what grow up to 20% okay and then go to looks and say set size okay so go to look and say set size to 100 so i don't want this 100 so i'll use a operator okay so i go to operator and i'll search pick random from 1 to 10 is there right so i'll make it 12 so anyway pick random sizes okay and i call my 
block that is random grow and shrink so now i have to create okay we have, we have already created a block right so now i have created three clones right so what happens when i start as a clone so i go to my control and i say when i start as a clone it should pick up random position okay so clones should be in the random position so i go to looks and i say show okay okay show then again i say set size to random position so go to operator and pick random 1 to 12 okay and i again go to my blocks and i call my block grow and i'll say up to 20 percent okay and once okay all the balls all the, all the my balls comes on the stages okay then it should delete okay so i go to control and i say delete this clone and we will run the program and say if it is working no it's not working it's not working why it's not working i have not closed my script so go to my blocks and i say random grow and shrink and run the program yes can you see students randomly in different places of the stage okay randomly in different stages and different places of the stage understood students so kindly practice this code okay it's very simple code kindly practice the same you can use okay different sprites instead of a ball you can use a balloon you know and etc understood students so kindly practice the same thank you students